guys welcome back to the channel if you're new to the channel welcome to the channel today i'm introducing red my lovely citron dispatch that i picked up a couple of weeks ago but yeah i'm going to give you a little van tour so at the moment the van is very minimal i haven't done anything to it yet it's literally as i bought it so we've got the three seats in the front here everything's pretty clean and everything um now i do just need to fix this is a bit loose i want to get a bluetooth radio so I bought the van from the loveliest Brazilian couple. They were so nice and actually they gave me this Mi Casa Su Casa cushion to keep. So I thought that was really cute. So I have that here in the front and I'm thinking of getting some other cushions. Now it's really good to go. Like I could use this tomorrow if I wanted, but I would like to maybe, I don't know, like get a rug for the front or like get some nice material and like recover the seats or something. I want it to be quite cozy, but at the moment it's very clean, very minimal just like just what you need if you wanted to go straight away so here we have the back again it is very small i mean it's just a citron dispatch but we basically got a couch that pulls out into a bed i'll show you that in a second we've got our cabinet here now i do have a big gas cooker and a sink to go in here i just need some waste and fresh water tanks to go here and i do have a fridge here as well so the couple actually left me with the fridge that they had and it's absolutely perfect because it's a really nice size i would never fit a full size fridge in here along the sides of the van we have these little storage pieces we've one on this side we've got blackout curtains at the back i've got a like sunroof here with a blackout cover to go over at night time i've got some lovely usb lights which were also left to me by the last owners and they also left me this like storage thing here which is handy because it's so small i think i'll be delighted with any storage i can find i do want to make somewhere else to hold this like even like on the roof or something because like you know when i'm driving that won't bother me but i want to be able to slide little boxes here to have like my clothes and shoes and everything for when i actually go away Okay, so I'm trying to figure out how I'm going to show you how the bed works. So basically, I have to drag out this massive cushion. Wouldn't be a bad idea to have someone here to help me with this. Basically, the bottom panel just pulls forward the whole way. And the cushion pops on top like that. So it basically makes a small double bed. So yeah, basically that's it. Fits, I'd say it would com comfortably fit two people. Definitely no more than two people though. God, I'm absolutely wrecked now. I don't want to have to put it back in. So this is the camping cooker my dad bought me actually as a gift. So it is the camping chef camping chef folding so yes very excited to put this in but yeah when i saw the van i was absolutely delighted with the wooden flooring and the wooden panels on the ceiling which also have some insulation behind them so I always said that if I wanted a van, I wanted like a wooden floor and wooden panelling on the sides. And my dad actually told me at the time that like I would never find that in my budget and that I didn't need it anyway. So when I did see this van in budget, I couldn't believe that it had the wooden floor and the panelling. And I feel like I just knew. I just knew from there. But yeah, so that's red. In terms of changes, nothing major. I wouldn't mind like reupholstering this in like a nice material that I've picked out, maybe making some new curtains, obviously putting in the sink and the cooker is the main thing just so that I can use it. But I actually do have a little, you know, like a transportable camping cooker that I could use anyway if I wanted to go away tomorrow. So that's really it. I think I will do a little bit of a series on like the few little bits I do over time, maybe like another van tour in like six months after I've used it because chances are I will figure things out that I want and make some little changes so I will do that again in future and I will do some videos of my my trips this summer so yeah if you want to see those subscribe to the channel and yeah chat to you after